Hi everyone, welcome to a new vlog. I've got my banana and Nutella on toast. Honestly, Nutella is my my vibe at the moment. I mm, I just can't get enough. So welcome to another video. Now today's video is taking a different plan than I originally thought. We're going for a date with ourselves because at the moment I'm really just going through a phase of treating myself. Forget hot girl summer, it's self care summer. I literally am the biggest advocate for going places by yourself, treating yourself, letting you have a little bit of you time. I love it. And what I was going to do was going to do like a full on date date. We were going to go to a pottery place and paint pottery, fun. And then we were going to go and watch In the Heights, in the, in the theatre. I really wanted to, I really, really wanted to. In the Heights is all booked up for today and the pottery place is shut. So instead, we're still gonna have a self-care self -care summer moment. And it is chucking it outside, so it does have a Christmas vibe. And stop, stop, because I want Christmas so badly. Like, I just need it in my life. I, oh, I'm going through, the, it happens, it's cyclical. I feel like it happens in June every year, in September, and then from September onwards, I'm just so ready for Christmas. I just, the weather is making me feel Christmassy and I'm just so excited for Christmas. Okay, some of you I know really disagree with that. But there are, there are some of you watching who also, I've already started watching Zoella's Vlogmases from about seven years ago. I love them. They are my comfort, my comfort videos. I love it. Anyway, we're gonna go on a little venture. It's gonna be a fun time. It's gonna be pretty chill. So buckling with seat belts. Whoa, it feels like we're back, I don't know, like two years ago. I don't know why, this is just giving me real like old school vibes. Can't work out, can't put my finger on it. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to town. We're gonna go to the shopping center because I am very excitingly going for afternoon tea on the weekend. Um, so I want a nice outfit. I actually haven't been clothes shopping in time. I very rarely go clothes shopping. Um, but I like, I want a nice outfit. All right, so I'm gonna go and see what's, see what's popping off in there. And I also think I'm gonna buy a new camera. I think I'm gonna make the investment because my camera is broken. And obviously I can't make any vlogs if I don't have a camera. So we're gonna try a new one. Um, because I normally use a Canon G7X, which is currently what you're on. Not that anyone really cares. I mean, I care actually because the whole reason I'm trying a new camera is because your mum Ashley um, said what camera she was using and it was such nice quality. I was like, I'm gonna give that a go. Um, so let's go and I'm also gonna get, I'm just gonna treat myself. I'm gonna get a bubble tea. I love bubble teas. I'm probably, we'll just see where the world takes us. Get a nice outfit. Get also, I got a gel manicure the other week um, and it's trashed my nails a little bit. I don't know if you can see. They're like a bit trashed. So I want to get something to like, we can do a little manicure when I get back home because I want to like do some nail oil or something because they are trashed. And I never do, I never get nails done or anything like that. So I don't know how people's nails aren't more trashed. Like this is after one time. One time! I'm gonna put some songs on. Obviously I love shouting out. I think that's why my voice still hasn't really come back from the wedding the other week because I've just been singing my heart out. Can't stop. Right, let's put some music on. Let's get Google Maps up because I can't for the life of me remember how to drive to places. No matter how many times I've been there, I can never remember how to get back to locations. Actually guys, I think I might do a podcast. Should we listen to a podcast? Do you want a chewing gum? Oh, you know what? I need to do my car service when I get back. I haven't done that in ages. Okay. Right, I have arrived at the shopping centre. And it was the weirdest thing, on the motorway, um, there was a tractor, but the road was closed. So we were literally all just following this tractor at like 20 miles an hour on a motorway, which <laughs> was a fun time. Woo, it was a good time. Um, let's go to the shopping centre. So, agenda in the shopping centre. I'm really excited actually. I haven't been like shopping in a long time. So, we're gonna look for an outfit for afternoon tea. So it's to be a little bit fancy. We're gonna get a new camera. Oh, I'm so excited to get a new camera. Oh, I love it. Do you remember when you were younger and you used to get a new um, a new phone and it would be the most exciting thing, the most exciting thing, setting it up, like, cause, and playing around with it. But now, because you kind of just get the same phone, but it's just, like, upgraded a little bit. Yeah, and I just miss that. And I feel like with a camera that this is the excitement that it's going to bring. I'm really excited. We're going to get a bubble tea and some stuff for my nails and potentially a lush moment. See if there's any bath bombs for myself. Um, because as I said, this is all about treating myself. We're here to pamper us at the end of the day. We're the most important people in our lives. We're the ones that we're with all the time. So we have to be nice to us, do you know what I mean? <laughs> Hello, 
don't have sprinklerinos. Right, I'm back from my shopping expedition, which was highly unsuccessful. Basically, curries are closed. So I can't buy a camera. I just can't believe it. What are they are. Secondly, there were no clothes. And then when I get bored that I'm not seeing any clothes I like, I end up browsing like all the home sections and water stones. And I mean, I did get, I'm gonna see my haul, some gorge sexy wireless bras. Still late, not wireless. Yeah, wireless, wireless. Um, I then got a present, I'm just gonna show you a corner, for my friend. Um, and then I got for myself, so my sister when she moved out, she took this with her, because it was hers, the Mindfulness um, Colouring Book, and it's a great one, I really like this one. Also it's good because it's small, so when you go on holiday, and this is like what you want to do on holiday or anything, you don't have to take a fat book with you. So I needed to get one of these, so I got one, and I love it, and it's great. Um, I really enjoyed my time in Waterstones actually. I just like, this is what I mean by I'm either... There's no in between. I'm like an 80 year old woman and the things that I enjoy. I just enjoy like simple things. Like I enjoy baking. I enjoy pottering out around the house. I enjoy home stores. But then I'm also the excitableness of a three year old. It's like there's no, there's no middle ground. Um, and then I'm about to go and visit my friend, spontaneous. Woo! Um, actually, Bilbo. If you're on, if you watch Extra Grack, you would know about Bilbo. Um, and I got her some Millie's cookies. We've got a variety. Thing is, she doesn't really like any flavours that aren't chocolate cookies. One of these. I got some like Smarties ones, white chocolate. I got one white chocolate and raspberry because I didn't know if she'd like that, but then I thought her husband might like that. And then, for myself, I got a bubble tea. Strawberry boba and apple tea. Do you know what I'm really into lately? Watching Synchronised Swimming on YouTube. Really? It's like, you know when ASMR was a thing? Just really calming to watch. And they're just so talented. Anyway. Oh, we nearly had some splash back there. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. I really enjoy this. It's just such an exciting texture. I'm such a texture person. And that is a fancy car. What do you do? Because you're very young. Or is it your parents? I'm always so intrigued. So nosy. I could literally sit and people watch all day long. My favourite thing to do with it. So I'll show you. I like to put it in here. And it like moves. Mm. Mm. Yeah, it's his pizza. Woo! -hoo. That one must be yours, that big one. I think, yeah, the big one <laughs> is mine. Oh, yeah, Dip. Oh! Are you happy? Oh, and look who it is! The star of the show, who everyone loves with their whole heart. Just say hi again. Hello. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah. We've gone for a veggie with olives. Yes. Billy! Come here. What? Great! Woo! <laughs> my children, just pamper time. I had a nice time at my friend's house. And I'm back. And I'm going to do my, I got this nail vitamin E oil thing. Thanks, Mother Booth. I'm going to, actually, before I do that, I'm going to use this buffing thing to try and sort them out. But I don't know if it's going to work. It's like we're having a slumber party. Big thing happened tonight. Like, I was in shock. So when I was on my way to my friend's, from the shopping centre. Obviously we all know Radio 1 is my favourite radio station. Talk about it quite a lot actually. Um, and I'm just listening, I, the, Nick Grimshaw, who is the Radio 1 DJ that was, that's on in the afternoon, Grimmy, was like, there was this lady on tick, there was this lady called Grace on TikTok. I was like, oh my gosh, my name is Grace. And then they played my TikTok on Radio 1 on prime time. We found this lady Grace on TikTok and Grace makes a very good point. I just got the vaccine and I made, could not believe it. I was literally like, what the heck? And then so many of you messaged me and I was like, guys, I know because I listen to Radio 1 all the flipping time. I just couldn't believe it. I was literally like, is this a dream? Am I in real life? Um, so that was quite a fun little afternoon surprise. And then I also got some DMs from you guys who I only was going to think in today, when is the cool lime refresher coming back to Starbucks? Because it hasn't been back in ages. Um, and then all you've been messaging me saying, apparently the cool lime refresher is officially back. So maybe tomorrow, to finalise our little day's adventure, um, we could go and try that and see if it's as good as it used to be like, right, shiny. And now we're just going to take some of this. Um, right on the nail, and I think we just moisturise it in. Vitamins and minerals, very important, aren't they? I'm gonna do this, and I'll see you in the morning. I flipping love you guys so much. Because if it wasn't for you, I wouldn't be here right now at Starbucks about to order myself a cool lime refresher. I've literally waited for this day for years and years. That's no exaggeration. Like, since they discontinued it about five years ago. 
Oh, I thought it went off the thing. Should I just try every flavour? They've got the coconut stub. This they've got the pink drink. They've got the flipping pink drink. Stop. I'm right. I'm gonna add that, and then I'm also gonna go for the cool lime refresher. Do I try that acai one as well? Nah. We'll just go for the. Let's not get too ahead of ourselves. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> okay, guys. So. I have already consumed it. I did a little TikTok. Grace Peace Night 7 if you want to check that out. The cool line refresher is everything. Mm. Everything I ever remember. It's delicious. Mm -hmm. It's so good. It tastes like a mojito. It, it actually tastes a little bit sweeter than I remember. I thought I would try a pink drink. Because I never got to try one before. See, because they've never done them in the UK. It's not as pink as I thought they would be. But. It's disgusting. I don't like it at all. Like, at all. There's not one bone of my body that likes that. But I like this with my whole heart. I pray that they keep this forever because it's literally the best drink. Hands down, it's the best drink. Starbucks do. Why can't they do it all year round? Why does it have to be summer edition? Who said that it's a summer summer drink? I'd have it in winter. I would. And there's no discrimination here. Hi, guys. It is the next day. And I know it started off with, like, self self-care moment. Um, but i am actually going for a picnic today with someone that i know you guys love i'm going for a picnic with taz i haven't seen her since for a long long time um and we're going to greenwich which should be nice i don't think she's ever been before um and i just thought it'd be nice to take the vlog along i don't know she might be vlogging because i think she's actually started posting on her like uh, second channel as well i'm really like tempted hear me out to do something like vlogmas which I, uh, vlogmas for me was i posted every other day because my life isn't exciting enough to post every day um although you guys always like you don't mind me just pottering around you like that is that i don't think that's a little part i'm trying to do parks i want to do plats um i'm really tempted in like august or something i don't know when the best time to do it is to post every other day do like a uh, I don't know what you'd call it because it wouldn't be vlogmas. Is my life that exciting to do that many vlogs? I don't think so. Um, so anyway, I'm just getting ready to go to Greenwich now. Okay, we've done my hair. Oh, I don't know if I'm into it. I think that will be fine. Um, I'm going to put my SPF. This, genuinely I speak about it quite a lot. This Skin Defense Multi Protection Lotion from Body Shop is my favourite moisturiser. It sinks into the skin so nicely, but it's also SPF 50 plus. And I genuinely like, I haven't gotten burnt or anything during the time of wearing this. And um, SPF used to really break me out every time I wore it, but this one doesn't. So highly recommend Shower Body Shop. When I was in Boots the other day, um, I needed some sun cream. So I bought this sun care stick and I got this sun care roll on and they're so good because obviously they're quite small so they fit in your bag really easily and you just go like this this one you just go like this and it like doesn't even leave a white residue or anything like you literally just put it straight on the skin great and then this one you just go like this and if you download the Boots app um, you get I think I got 15% off. Honestly, if you don't have a Boots Advantage card, please get one. I have £37 saved on mine. And I'm saving for a nice perfume. That's what I'm doing on my Boots Advantage card. So this one is like a deodorant. But this one you don't do get white um, residue from it. So that's good. But then, with that, you got a free water bottle. How good is that? I actually think I'm going to take this today because it's not too big, is it? Yeah, I'm going to take... I was going to give this to a kid, I know, but... Sorry, kid. I'm taking it. I'm very happy with that, actually. <laughs> I hear it's wow. I'm it. just going to be like, yeah, you can put that. Can we see the screen and all that? Well, okay. barely, because my camera oh, can we show, broken. Can... Yeah, do you, do they, can they, can I vlog your camera so they can see what your camera looks like? Oh so my broken. God, it's so funny. Her camera's completely broken. It's got like sellotape all over. I love it. I love it. And I love all of this. Look at oh, all the food. Yeah, go and show what you've okay. got. So I've got myself, well we're sharing. Uh, this is so cute, a kebab. Uh, They're really cute. Uh, fruit platter. Got myself a tuna and pasta salad. Um, got myself a mini sushi. Okay vlogger, yeah. I see you. And a bit of oh, is it going to be windy? Yeah, it's going to be windy. What about on um, We've also got some Colin the Caterpillar mini ones. Taz has never tried. You don't have to try because you're not. Are you a big chocolate? 
The mini I'm ones? Crazy. I think I have tried the mini oh, ones. Oh, fab. Because okay, I remember you buying one. one big kick and they had mini ones on the side of it. So then you bought the big one and they had mini ones on the side of it. I've never seen that. Oh, I don't know where it got from, but it, That's it's a thing. Cool. Yeah. I like that. And then I got this salmon poke bowl and my favourite crisp in the whole world. Again, you've not tried these, right? I've had something similar maybe, but not... Okay. Well, these are the best crisps in the whole world. And now we're going to go and chat for ages. It's going to be like a therapy session. We've already chatted for a long time. But where are we? We're at Greenwich. It's very beautiful. This and it's very nice. beautiful, little Faye. Bye. Bye. I'm home from my adventures with Taz. It was so flipping nice to see her. I had so much fun. I love that gal with my whole heart. Um, she is just a great, great gal. Um, and it's so nice to just chat the day away. Um, however, I was hit with hay fever because I think we were sitting in a um, freshly mown, freshly lawn mowed, I don't know how to say that, um, bit of the park. And I was just sneezing, like I literally sneezed so much, I, yeah, it was not a fun time. So I've heard that apparently this is the secret if you have bad hay fever and nasal rinse. So I'm gonna give it a go. I'm a little bit terrified because it just doesn't seem right, <laughs> but we're going to see if it works and if I feel any better and then hopefully you guys will also um, be able to know whether you should do it or not. Um, but let's do it at our own risk, okay? Cat the sinus packet. So it comes with these packets and we're going to see if it works. So you have to use proper distilled water or bottled water or something. So I've put on, popped in distilled water. And then I've just added in the powder and you give it a good shake. You basically bend forward and shove it, I think, in your nose. I'm literally so nervous. Ah! Oh, that is not nice. Ah. Stuff is, a lot of stuff is coming out. Right. <laughs> I don't know what I was expecting, but it wasn't that. <laughs> 